Chase Headley is our forward power player of the day. He gets traded to the Yankees, hits the game-winning single and extra innings. Is he the missing piece, Albert, for this New York team? I don't know if he's the missing piece, but I think he definitely can help them. Off to a great start last night. He's in the dugout shaking, you know, introducing himself during the game to players, and he goes out and gets the game-winning hit. Unbelievable start for him. All they're asking for is that he gives them kind of a jolt of energy. He's a two-month rental, and he can do that. He's proven that he can hit home runs in a short period of time, and I think that's kind of just all they're asking for. Ted, really. is it more about Headley, or is it more about the Yankees potentially getting another front-line starter? Will that be the difference on whether or not they make the playoffs? Yeah, I mean, this is a team that lost four-fifths of its uh, starting rotation before the season, so unless they improve there, they're not going anywhere. They're still really a 500 team. The offense, they have the guys in the lineup right now who I think could do the job offensively if they start performing like it. Brian McCann, Mark Deshera, who's going on the DL, Carlos Beltran, Jacoby Ellsbury not hitting for the same kind of power. Uh, as we've seen him do before, but the average is okay. Uh, even Derek Jeter, I mean, those are some big-time names that just aren't playing up to their capabilities right now. And if they do, and the addition of Headley, the offense, you know, should more or less be okay. But, you know, a rotation led by Brandon McCarthy and Hiroki Kuroda is no one's idea of a playoff rotation. they got to help that. And, and the thing is, the AL East this year, I mean, you're looking at an incredibly mediocre division. I think, you know, GM Brian Cashman recognizes that. I think everyone in the division recognizes that. 88 wins is probably going to get you the division. So it's not like you have to make a deal for David Price to win the division. I think the Yankees have been smart. You know, nice move to get Brandon McCarthy. I think the Headley deal is a good move. And I think if they make another one or two moves, I think they're absolutely in a good position to win this division. Headley's been been really strong as of late, hitting 339, four doubles, one homer, eight RBI in 13 games since July 4th. You expect him to keep up those kind of numbers? Well, just two years ago, this guy hit 31 home runs. It had an incredible second half. But for the most part, he just hasn't been the same kind of guy. Then again, he's coming from Petco Park, pitcher-friendly ballpark, to Yankee Stadium. He's been playing for miserable teams. So maybe playing for you know a good team, he's in a contract year, is going to inject some life into his game. Yeah, I mean, they love having those lefties in Yankee Stadium in that lineup. So that could help. You, you mentioned he's got power and was doing it at one of the hardest ballparks to hit a home run at in the majors uh, historically. Now he's going to one of the easiest ones. So that'll help. But uh, you know, to me, I'm going to be skeptical of the Yankees right up until I see them improve that pitching. And the question for them is, even if they get in, if it's going to be as a wild card, that's a 50-50 coin flip game. Who is their option to start that game? There's no Sabathia. There's no Tanaka. There's no even Pineda or Nova. Uh, it, it could be a short postseason, even if the Yankees get there to a wild card game. So how many more trades do you really want to make in the, in the name of getting to play one game in October? Hit me. Hey there, SI fans. I hope you enjoyed this clip from our daily live show, SI Now. You can find a link to the complete episode in the description box below. And while you're there, make sure you subscribe to Sports Illustrated's YouTube channel. Remember, you can watch SI Now Monday through Friday live at 1 p.m. Eastern time only on SI.com. All right, go along. You ready? Hope to see you there.